is hand releasing enough? Well, in some situations it is, and I wish it was that simple to go, yes it is or no it isn't. Personally, our belief we prefer to chemical release our plants because we know that we can knock down and actually kill that grass that's around that plant. We can lay that grass down then as a mulch around that plant and actually get a longer period where it's not getting grown back over and, and, and having competition that's going to kill that plant. Some species are more susceptible than others and some will actually be fine just with a hand release. And on some sites, a hand release is fine and at certain times of the season, if you can actually get enough grass away from that plant, that's fine as well. But if you want a really good result that you can rely on, we strongly recommend a chemical release. And when we do our releasing, we'll often do a bit of hand releasing to get the grass away from the plant, and then we'll come around and we'll chemical release it as well. And then you know that you've created that perfect well and a nice little happy ecosystem for that tree to grow in. And then once it's up above the grass, it's away. But if you're hand releasing, that grass is gonna keep growing back, it's gonna fall onto that plant, and you're not gonna get the same results. So everyone's got a different opinion, but for us, a chemical release for sure.